Puerto Rico. Welcome back to Bud's Breakdown, right here on Talking Turks with District Davis. I'm your host, DJ Bud. Uh, this week we're going to talk about some fly shit, some extra real fly shit. Some fly shit. Um, a sneak album coming out from one of hip hop's best uh, classic <laughs> lyricist MCs, Ghostface Killer. Unexpected uh, project. The new album is called Ghostface Killer. Oh, gang. So if you see the album cover, uh, it's very uh, gang, gang. Uh, the theme is lots of stick ups, you know, you know, ghost face shit. Uh, if you were watching the Wu Tang saga on Hulu, you'll see that Ghost Face was involved with in some shit uh, early with uh, Ray Kwan. Uh, I don't know if you, yo, that shit is crazy. Uh, I don't want to ruin it for you, but like, make sure you watch that shit. If you got a fire stick, yo, hit me up. I'll show you the cheat code so you can get all the shows. Uh, you know, I'm a nice guy. Uh, You're a nice but guy seriously like though, the Ghostface album, yo, the shit is thick. It's weird because because it doesn't have Raekwon on it at all. Uh, and you would think, you know, Ghost and Raekwon, they always yeah, tour sure. together. You know, they made like classic material together. You would think this shit would be on its shit. But then, so, but why, why killers? Why the plural? Maybe he's like saying like it's mine, it's Ghostface Killers. Like what? What is the? You know what I'm talking about? He's. It's almost like he's trying to indoctrinate like a new generation because it's of Ghostface Killers. I got you. Like like a dope so like a legion of Ghostface yeah, Killers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he has you. a son on his album. Oh, that's dope as fuck. Yeah, so he works with his son. Yeah, yeah. So his son's on there. Capadonna's on there. Fucking um, Capadonna. He put his number in the song for for you <laughs> young niggas that yeah. don't know. Cap- Madonna's is on like three joints. Fuck yeah. Um, uh, Inspector Dex on there. Inspector. Method Man is on that joint. Like rip, op- rips it open like very nice on the intro track. So uh, it's thick. It's thorough. Um, it's a quick listen though. It's only like 40 minutes. So what is it? Um, this is an EP. You know, it's still an LP. It's 14 tracks. Damn. Yeah, he split it. And it's got skits. And it runs that quickly. That's what's up. The song just got a, he gets like a verse, maybe two verses, and he's out. So, and and, and, and we just reviewed, we just did another Wu member we album, just, right? Exactly and, exactly. and and that was that we just uh, talked about Inspector Deck. Yep. You know, that was the, very the Inspector Deck joint. Uh-huh. So, uh-huh. And, and you said Inspector's on this project. Inspector Deck is on this joint, giving back. You know, Ghostface is actually putting this out on his label first. Uh, so go to his uh, website. And um, but you know he, everybody else is gonna have it. I think after this week on like Spotify, Tidal, all that other shit, Apple Music, uh, so you can stream it. Unless you just wanna buy it from Ghostface. Gang, gang, gang. Yo, this shit is fucking dope. Uh, it's a strong listen. Uh, the beats are thorough. The, the producers, the cat who did uh, the joints for Inspector Deck and Danny Calizo. But yo, the joints is thorough. If you have seen the video. So, with him and the dead president's makeup. Where's RZA? Um, yo, RZA is show writing the fucking Hulu show and probably trying to make 36 Chambers so then, a brand again. No, I was just saying this to, to go back to, again, the Inspector in, uh, review yes. where we, we said there was no production from, from RZA either. No production from So RZA. then this is, not, this is not something that like Inspector got slighted or something. Just no. Niggas just ain't getting beats from RZA. No, nobody's getting right beats. Right around niggas, nobody's getting beats. So it's like, so not like he got curved. Remember, like when, I remember we talked about, like, man, maybe he got a little curved, but like now it makes sense to me. RZA isn't giving any beats to anybody because RZA thinks he's above making beats for just rap shit. He's elevated. He's on another He wants echelon. to only do scores and such. Yes, he's on another like echelon, as Nas would say. Gotcha. Another echelon. But overall, yo, the album is fucking dope. Um, yo, the shit is thorough. Ghostface the is cover the art is through. fucking crazy, bro. Yo, it's, it's a strong listen. I love the cover it's art. It's damn near perfect. Like, yo, if you want to get like four and a half judges on something, put it on this ghost face. Wow. I, I dare anybody to challenge me on that one. So this just got four and a half out of five. This, this shit is powerful shit. Wow, so this is a high ranking review shit, right here. Yo, please, please tell me what track. Please prove you wrong. No, yeah, hit me up. That's what it, I'm gonna make sure I give it a listen. 
Hit me up in the comments. So yeah. Tell me what you think? Man, listen. I think that uh, I got to give this a listen tomorrow. Like it's yes. gonna, it's probably gonna be, it's gonna be on my my heavy rotation tomorrow. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna give you my opinion of this shit. I mean, I don't expect it to not be dope, man. Ghost. I mean, like, come on, it's ghost. It's fire. It's fucking Trust ghost. It's fire. Front to back, like you just spitting front to back. It's short. It's just like rapid fire shit. It's like going to one of his shows. Cause like one of his, you know, all of his shows, he really just does like a verse. Or it's like two verses of a song and he's out. You're good in the mail. And then it's like. So, you know, that's what shows really just kind of. Uh, it makes sense to him to do songs that's a little more rapid fire to kind of curtail to like people's appetite and ADD and shit like that and attention span. So it makes sense. I got ADD. And, you know, more power to you. More power to you. It's all good. It's, it's all good if you do. It's all good if you don't. No, I got A D D D D. Oh, don't tell us what that shit is, please. I got A D D D D. No, okay. No. So, bro. Thank you. Thank so you. last week we had to kind of cut it a little short. Yes. And and I know you had something real important you wanted sure to hit on. Fucking did. And, and you know some developments happened since that time. Um. Yeah, I mean I'm sure you got more to add to it now. You know I do have a little shit to get off my fucking chest. What 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 grills my toast? Tell him why you're mad, son. Tell him why you're mad, son. Well, let me just tell you why I'm fucking mad. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> all right. So we already know that shit is fucked up. The environment is fucked up. Yep. Air is fucked up. The our, water's fucked up. Our planet's up. lungs the are planets deteriorating are rapidly. are fucked up, right? The fucking Amazon rainforest is burning like a motherfucker. People are just like, oh, I don't know. What, do, what should we do? Little or no, and come to find out that some capitalist who bought up all this shit and is burning it up to be a fucking dickhead. Yeah. So here we are. The environmental uh, impact on everybody, not just those people who live in those indigenous places, because those people are probably people of color. Yeah, those are our lungs burning. Those are so indigenous what is it people. A, is it like 25% of our lungs or 20% of our lungs or something like that? And nobody's out there checking that shit. Yeah. Nobody's out there checking that shit. So the environmental issue... But is, this is like it's irreversible. It's fucking... No, it's, yeah, this is, like, this is like irreparable damage. And that's what the fucking... That's what people are putting into the environment there in the Amazon. So in America, we got people putting other kind of shit into the environment, like gunplay. Yeah. So, you know, we thought there was going to be an issue. We thought we were going to be able to stop the shit when they shot the kids at their fucking school. Yeah, yeah. Then they shot up the old black ladies at the church. Yeah, they did. Then they shot up the Jewish people at the synagogue. Yes, they did. I was like, damn, who else do they have to shoot to fucking stop? There's a ma there's a mass shooting, like Dude, it's like, it's like every, every week now. Week it's like every fucking there's, weekend. There's more mass every shootings. Weekend. There's a, you get a mass shooting before you get a UFC. Dog. It's like disgusting. It's disgusting. And if you if you look at where all these things are happening, yeah. It, it, it's unnecessary. But you can't speak but you know, we have an issue. Look, Virginia Beach, man. I don't know how to solve it. Please, yo, hit me up in the comments. Let me know what you think. How do we solve this shit? Because it's fucking ridiculous. Yeah, definitely. We we, we would love to, to, to hear your and thoughts on And why do they keep shooting the up comments. Walmart? What the fuck? Why do you keep shooting up Walmart? Walmart is awesome. What the fuck? Don't shoot Walmart. I'm just trying to save a couple bucks. I don't need to get shot. Great value. Please. Please. Stop that shit. Stop that shit. Don't shoot Walmart, yo, man. Yo, appl applaud to Walmart, though, for taking a stance and saying, yo... Don't bring a gun to our fucking store, please. But they also didn't say we're gonna stop selling guns. They, no, they're not gonna stop selling guns because they still need. They, they need to keep. They're like, money. yo, look, my nigga, you could leave here with a gun. You just can't come here with one. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't want you fucking bucking off in the fucking scan aisle. And so, shit. like, am I wrong or does that sound crazy? No, no, that's okay, fucking cool. real. That's right, that's cool. where we are. 2019. Remember cool. this fucking. Remember these fucking days, man. Remember these fucking. So I'm days. not just high. Motherfuckers were bringing in fucking. Assault rifles to fucking go get their oranges. Yeah. For what? Yeah, but you need an AR to go For get an what? avocado. What? Hey, honey, get me my Uzi. I've got to go get some nectarines. Where's the grocery list? What the fuck? Who? Are you, what are you protecting? 
Anyway, anyway, tell me what you think about that because I don't know what the fuck I need to fix it. But you know, Florida's lit. Motherfuckers out there standing their ground for no reason. Yo, Florida is way yeah. This super stand my groundy. Flo- every every bad thing that starts is, is like Florida man. So if you know about that shit, I think we could have a whole show called Florida man. Yo, definitely. We could definitely. do a whole show called Florida man. Shouts to ATL. And every that day, just do this day in Florida man history and do you just watch do it all uh, no, I've seen, I heard about Florida Man though. Oh, too, like, you need to watch that shit tonight. Tonight, ATL? Tonight. 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 So apparently, I got to watch a show called Addle. Yes, El- Atlanta. Shout. Uh, so yeah, uh, but you know, when you're going and you're looking at some shit and you're looking at places like Atlanta, you don't draw this big extra line around Atlanta and say, oh, oh, this is Atlanta too, and be halfway up into Virginia thinking, yeah. oh, shit. But, you know, some people think if you get a map and you get a Sharpie, you can just change maps however the fuck you want to change yeah. them. So we have been brought to an age where motherfuckers just have no shame anymore at all. They will double, triple, quadruple down on this shit because they are just so so stupid and cannot accept the fact they're wrong do we have some footage of the the fucking uh piece in question okay so we have this month oh this right? is sharpie gate this is sharpie gate so you know just think about this shit your commander in chief is bringing to you some shit not mine that he just scribbled with a sharpie on the end because he needed to prove that he was right because you know in the conference room he was like is this the right map are you sure because you this doesn't have alabama circled on it so he didn't try to get a white sharpie he got a black sharpie damn can you at least try a little bit harder damn you didn't even try this this shit looks so added a little tumor yo he ate he Yo, that's a little feel. He, like, he was like, yo, I'm going to just put a little nipple on, oh, this, on this sperm. Yo. It looks like a sperm with a nipple. I, yo, I finally figured out what it is. He thought it was a drawing of a shrimp. And he was putting the little bubble, the angler on the on oh. the tip. Oh, he thought it was a drawing. Oh. He wasn't trying to say it was in Alabama. It was a drawing. Everybody. Good old shrimp dick in chief. Oh, so this is our guy. This is our guy. This is the person who was leading us supposedly in the free world. So if you don't like this shit, you know what the fuck to do between now and November. Get your ass registered to vote because we can't have fucking Sharpie Gate running yeah. my fucking life for the next four years. I agree. Now in June. So Please. You know what the thing is? Please. DJ Bud, you know what I love about you? What's that, Papa? Bro, you're not just a fucking fancy luchadore mask and, and some turntables. You got fucking opinions and, and, you, and, you, and you word them eloquently. There's a man. You're so me. much more than just a DJ and meathead. I love you, bro. Yes, there's so much more. You know what I'm saying? So look, man, that's I think I think it's safe to say that's Bud's breakdown, right? That is Bud's fucking breakdown. Look, man. Yes. I think we 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 I think we just killed it, bro. Yo, please. I think we up, just man. killed please. it. We you know it. what I'm saying? We love it. And so um, it is. Get that ghost face, please. Ghost face killers. Make um, sure you guys hit that, you know, them like buttons. Turn on the uh subscribe, you know, make sure you guys go to the uh you know, quality content productions page. Yeah, yeah. To stay up to date on all of, you know, the happenings that are happening here on Talking Turtles with District Dabbers and Buzz Breakdown. You know, right, it'll be around here somewhere, you know. So this is the part of the show where we uh you know we we're, we're about to wrap it up, man. I wanna thank everybody, my studio audience for coming out and joining me tonight, man. Make a little bit of noise for yourselves. <laughs> Make sure you join us next week for another installment of the show that we lovingly refer to as Talking Tops with District Dabbers. Everybody make some motherfucking noise! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I 
Locked in a trick socket Cause I'm so in a pipe So here comes a shot from a troop to my people Say no evil, speak no evil Rugged Puerto Rican straight taking out simps Treating shorty mommies a shrimp gang some pimp Hitting 94 just in case you didn't know Blowing up spots making not spin block Clips in the air for voting cross everywhere Got the rock on, boom, I'm fucking I don't care